Hey, what is going on guys and welcome back to episode 5 of my Town Online journey to top 200 and in the US and uh, First off, I'd like to start off with a question question for you guys This I want to know whether or not you guys want to see me put up two videos per day or put up one video per day and have it where it is filled with attacks from just that day so you guys are like caught up with me because this current video right now this gameplay is actually from like two days ago two or three days ago and the trophy level that I am at is like 3,300 ish and I'm a lot higher than that right now so I want to know if you guys want me to keep you up to date as much as possible like literally same day kind of uh, updates kind of stuff but just let me know what you guys want in the comments below because I'm not sure what you guys want and if you do want to just see all the gameplay I have because I have days worth and like I have like 10 episodes worth of gameplay right now that I have to commentate over and I don't want to commentate over it all if you guys aren't going to enjoy that so just let me know what you guys want and if you want like a side video of all the gameplay so you guys can learn Lunian let me know but otherwise just leave it in the comments below what you guys think. Anyways, now that this raid is almost completely over, I guess I'll explain a little bit at the end here. I'm just going for loot. Threw down the rest of my minions and my queen, and there we go. Got the one star for ten trophies. Now this raid here, it was a common base like a couple months ago. Now it's not so much. It's pretty simple to raid with balloons and minions. And I, I actually get like one trophy from this guy because I spent like two hours searching. It was a long time and I couldn't find anything. So I decided to just stop searching for a bunch of trophies and search for some loot because I was running low. And this is what I found. And I knew I could win because the base is pretty easy. And basically I just attack them three or four main circle compartments with the archer towers in. But in this base, I actually didn't have to worry about the bottom one because he had a cannon in it, so that was easy for me. And already, I have most of the base open for my minions to kill. Uh, all them buildings with because they're out of range. And you're going to see the percentage shoot up real fast here. And then once I do that, I actually, I believe I saved my clan castle troops. Yeah, no, never mind, I use them in the bottom. Never mind. But still, 49% get the two gold storages on top and there we go one star but 250,000 gold so that wasn't bad and okay so here's a base I haven't seen before but it is fairly simple because a lot of the buildings were out of range and yeah that's kind of how it is in Champions League for at least half the bases I see is they have their it's either air defense and stuff in the center of the base or they have their buildings like pushed as far out as they can to try and prevent a hundred percent so basically a one star from a Lunian is a win to them I mean I assume I'm pretty sure it is but yeah so it's fairly simple up here it's just a fact of being dedicated and keeping on pushing and staying on for six hours straight it's it's hard but yeah you just gotta be dedicated and yeah so this raid is almost over 39 percent i started to like get a l i wasn't worried i was just like okay i better start paying attention here and i got 49 percent throw down the rest of my minions right dark elixir throw my queen at the top for a little bit of gold and that's it thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in my next episode